you guys so today i have another wish wedding ring video and there are a whole bunch i have probably like maybe 20 i'm not sure but i will have to say that there are some non-traditional rings in this mix so if you aren't into the classic wedding ring you'll probably want to watch this because there's some like good ones in here so let's jump into this all right i just counted them all and there are 19 packages there are 18 ring sets and one ring related item so let's get into it the first one this one was a dollar 85 and this did not look anything like the picture <laughs> Um, I can post a picture of, um, what it looked like, uh, in the pictures on the, um, website. Okay. So I couldn't find the link. So it's probably one that I was sent by mistake instead of a pair of shoes because that happened to me a few times. So yeah. Okay. And this one was, I don't know if I said the price. This one was $1.85. It's size five and... It's a little big, like very big, too big for me. Um, that's very gaudy. I'm not a huge gaudy person, um, like chunky, it's chunky. Um, I don't mind big if it's delicate big, but if it's chunky, it's just not my style. And this one's chunky and not my style, but nonetheless, it fits well. It is pretty, like um, it's not like there's nothing fallen out the diamonds are all in place well cubit cubit zirconium whatever they use the crystals they're all in place so i mean it's not a bad ring just not my style which is okay um i don't hate it so it's not bad quality is what i'm trying to say so yeah and this one actually fits so there are some that were too small and some that were too big that I ordered in size five. So you'll see some of them. This one was $2. Um, again, I ordered size five and I think they might've sent me a size six. It doesn't say the size on the, the package, but this one is big. I apologize if you hear noise, there's construction going on behind my actually this one it's loose but it's not too too loose so it's very pretty this is a rose gold and the stone this is one of the non-traditional ones because the stone if you can see has a light, very light subtle blue like aquamarine tint to it and it is so pretty it's very delicate looking um all the stones are in place so I think this is a beautiful ring. And that's what it looks like. So yeah, that one a win because very gorgeous. All right, next up, I paid 98 cents for this. Now this is another non-traditional ring. It is big and gaudy, but I wanted to get it because I wanted to see what it looked like because it looked really cool. Let me show you what it looks like um, in the picture. And I paid 98 cents for this one. So this is a yellow gold one and their gold is very yellow. Like if you can see, it's very yellow. Like it's not the traditional gold gold, it's yellow. But nonetheless that's okay this one does fit really well and it's a size five but it is again big and gaudy i probably won't be wearing this one but i just thought it was really neat looking like really neat looking with the heart and the way that this dips down into like i just thought it was neat so that's why i bought that one no complaints with that I knew it was gonna be big and I knew it was gonna be gaudy even though that's not my style. But again, I wanted to see what it looked like in person because it looked really cool. All right, next up, I spent $2.01 on this one. 
and this they sent me the wrong size they sent me a size six so unfortunately it is too big and this is and let me show you so it's got rhinestone the, the stones but it's got like it's separated like there is like gaps in between all of them which is like it's hollow so that looks really cool and i liked that design and i love the way it looks but unfortunately it is a little big so i can't really wear it i mean my fingers are swollen right now because um this room is very hot and when i get hot my fingers swell so this would not fit me <laughs> all year round kind of thing but yeah really pretty now there are some here that are way too small for me to even get on my finger um and this one i paid 95 cents for i did get a refund on this one and i did get a refund on this one because they sent me the wrong size but this one i got a refund because this was supposed to be a ring set let me show you what it's supposed to look like And again, I paid 95 cents, but they sent me two engagement rings and no wedding band, which I was kind of annoyed about. And they're a little loose. So I have two engagement rings, but no wedding band. It is very pretty, but I really wanted to see what it looked like with the band. Um, this is not something I would wear just by itself. And again, it is big they sent me I believe a size six instead of a size five even though it says size five but again I got a refund because oh there's a gnat that just flew into my eye um but yeah because they sent me two of the two pieces that weren't didn't go together all right so next up I paid $1.90 for this, and this I love. And normally rose gold does not fit me for some reason when they send it, but this one does. And this is a non-traditional ring. Okay, so it's rose gold, and it's three pieces. So this piece is very dainty. It goes down there. Then this piece, and it's the stone in the middle is like... Um, it's not a clear it's like almost a cream colored in the middle i don't know if you can see that but it's very beautiful i apologize for the noise and then this piece is very dainty and it goes on the end and that's what it looks like i love it it's so pretty now this is my type of gaudy because it's dainty gaudy and I love it. And I'm definitely going to be wearing this one. Totally worth it. Very beautiful. I can't really avoid the noise in the background. So I'll just talk louder. Um, it's been going on for a while. And it's going to continue to go on for a while. So this one I paid 96 cents for. And this is a size 5 as well. And I think this is one of the ones that is a little too small which I'm kind of disappointed about because this one's so pretty. So, oh, I got it on. Okay, okay. This, this piece, this piece fits. This piece won't go over my knuckle. As I'm going to have a hard time getting this off. This is so pretty. I love um, when it's simple like this, like the simple band, but with a big diamond like big tall diamond in the middle. I love that style and that is exactly what that is. If you can see, very pretty, very, very pretty and only 95 cents or 96 cents. So um, yeah, great deal for that. And actually I think I'd be able to wear this. It's gonna be a little hard to get off my fingers, especially in the summer, but I think in the winter, um, <laughs> Some of these small ones will be a little bit easier for me to wear because my fingers won't be swollen. Next up is, I paid 95 cents for this one. And this is what it looks like. Now this one I love. And this is one of the ones that a lot of times when I order ones like these, this 
doesn't r go over this like the bottom is is um too far down and then it's like stuck like this and it looks really really bad but this one it actually fuses together and I love that only um thing is there is a stone missing right there but that's okay it's not noticeable at all unless you're like in like someone's staring at it and inspecting it but I think this is really pretty I love what I love this one very pretty so next up I paid a dollar 97 for this one now this one this one wasn't what I expected either. And as soon as I turn my camera back on, the machines start up again. Um, I will show you a picture of what this one looked like. And now on, this is what it looks like. It is super big and gaudy. Now it is pretty, but it's just not my style again. So if this is your style, it's well made. It's nicely made. It sparkles. Um, I don't think I thought that this was so, um, I don't know, that there were so many stones in this one. Like I thought this was a stone in the middle for some reason, but yeah, not my style. But again, it fits, it's comfortable. Actually, it's really comfortable. Um, the inside so smooth but it's just not my style which is fine it's still well made next up i paid 92 cents for this one now this is one of the non non traditional ones this one and this one i don't think fits correctly this one is um it's got like blue opal kind of look with a diamond, diamond in the middle, which really pretty. Oh, it does fit. <laughs> okay. So well, I don't know why I thought that this one didn't fit, but that is really pretty. Now this is a little bit gaudy, but you know what? With the, um, with the blue on the sides and everything, I don't think it like, it looks good. I like it. And then there's a set of like three diamonds, three or four, four diamonds on each side of the big diamond. Really, really pretty. I really like this one. I don't know why my knuckle, I don't know why these are fitting over my knuckle today, but when I first opened them, they weren't, but the ones that were too big fit for some reason too. I don't know. It's a weird day. All right, next up, I paid 96 cents for this one. Now this one, I feel like it's exactly like this one. I accidentally ordered two, I think. I, yeah, if you can see, they're pretty much the same. This one's just a little bit wider but this one is too big. It says size five, but it's too big for my finger. Watch, it proved me wrong though, but just by looking at it, I can tell these are big, yeah. This is a size six or a size seven, it might be. But yeah, it's definitely too big. If you can see, there's a lot of space in between there. But this one shines a little nicer than this one, which stinks, but that's okay. It's still really pretty, and I will probably sell this one just because it's still really nice. It's just won't fit on my finger. So next up, I paid a dollar six for this, and I'm in love with this one. I've worn it several times already. Um, even before this video. Now it has worn on the inside just a little bit, but it does not turn my finger green, which is fantastic. This is definitely a non-traditional ring. This is a Wonder Woman ring, which is so neat. This goes on like this, which is her like, like her W kind of thing. And then this one with the red, I don't know that 
roll away. Ow. <laughs> now I can't get it off my finger. Okay, so it's got a red, like sort of oval stone in the middle and then all these little blue stones on the outside. And I think this is gorgeous. I love this ring. I'm obsessed, I wear it all the time, and it's totally fine that the gold is yellow because the yellowy gold actually goes really nicely with um, this set. So I'm super excited. This is my favorite out of all the rings. I'm in love. All right, next up, I paid $1.92 for this. Now this is not a ring, this is a ring sizer. So what it does is, did I say I paid $1.92? I don't remember, but this goes in here and then you just put it on your finger, pull it tight and it will tell you what size your ring is. So my pointer finger is a size seven and my ring finger, now it says I'm a size six, but I'm not. I gotta pull this like tight, tight, I guess. There we go. My ring finger is a size five. And I thought this would come handy, come in handy just to see what um, sizes my fingers are. Um, if I wanna order rings for a different finger than my wedding ring finger. And because I never know what size ring my husband is and he can never remember. So this is perfect um, for his fingers too. All right, next up I paid 90 cents for this one. This one's really pretty as well. This is a three ring ring. So this one and this one, I think they sent me the wrong, yeah. This one feels like it's the wrong size because it feels a little loose, but it starts with this ring right here. Then this ring goes and locks into here so that there's a diamond there. And then this one goes and locks right there so that there's three in a row going up your finger, which I think this is gorgeous, but again, too loose. This is um, not the right size and I just dropped one on the ground, but nonetheless made really well, very pretty and I like it a lot. So next up, I paid a dollar six for this. Now this, let me show you a picture of what it looked like in the pictures. Again, another non-traditional ring and I thought it looked so pretty, but when I got it, it's so big. It looks kind of silly on my finger. Like it's really tall. I didn't expect it to be that tall. But what it is, is this piece has a little divot and then this piece goes in here and it's like a fat heart with a big old diamond in the middle. It's pretty, but again, not my style, which that's fine. It's still a nice, well-made ring. All right, next up I paid $2.04 for this one. This is another non-traditional ring and I think this is one of the ones that don't fit me. Um, but I'm in love with it and I'm so mad. This piece, this piece fits on my finger just fine. Um, it's this piece that doesn't and I'm kind of upset about it, but I'm gonna see if I can find another ring um, just with, um, like this, whoops, I threw one with this that I can um, just put with it and it still looks really cute. But the stones, oh my gosh, they're gorgeous. They're these like deep blue stones and there's one here, 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 here with then three diamonds in between those. And I'm just going to have to put it on like this. And then this one has a big blue stone in the middle. Again, deep blue with diamonds all around it and down the sides. And it is so pretty. 
I love this and I'm so <laughs> bummed that this one doesn't fit. But again, I can put it on with just a regular band and it will, will still look pretty. So I'm probably gonna wear it like that with another band because I really don't wanna get rid of this because I love this blue stone. It is so, so pretty. Next up, I paid 96 cents for this one and this is kind of a repeat. Um, this is that teardrop stone that I have, which the one I have is a little bit loose on me and this one fits so much better. It fits perfectly and I'm so excited because I love, love, love the teardrop look. It's gorgeous. I mean, the stone is big, but it's, it's a nice big. I love it. All right, next up, I paid 93 cents for this, and I'm gonna show you what the picture on the site looked like. Now, I expect it to be, to be gaudy, but not this gaudy. Let me show you. Look how big that ring is. Like, oh my gosh. This is ridiculous. Like. I could barely close my fingers all the way. It reminds me of like a crown almost, like a tiara. It's just way too big. But nonetheless, it is well made. The diamonds are all in place. Um, everything is where it should be. So I can't really complain about that. Just again, not my style with the big and gaudy. And last up, I paid $1.98 for this. And this one I was upset about as well because one of the pieces does not fit. And I'll show a picture of what this one looks like because it is gorgeous. Now this piece fits. The diamond piece, as you can see, but this piece I can't get over my knuckle. And this is like the snowflake diamond. Oh, call me a liar. <laughs> I was able to fit it over my knuckle. Um, this one probably will need to wear in the winter because when my fingers swell, I'm not gonna be able to get it off and it's gonna hurt and blah, blah, blah. But I think this is gorgeous. I love it. So pretty. And I've been trying to get this one in my size for a cheap price for a long time and I finally found it so I'm so excited but yeah that is the last ring and as always if you're interested in purchasing any of these items the links will be provided in the description box down below you can just click on them and buy them so yeah that is everything and these mostly I love them um oh I dropped one and I do have to say that they are all nice quality. I know my last batch, there were, there were several duds where the diamonds were crooked, the diamonds were missing, um, they were very cheap looking, like they were gonna fall apart or like they came out of a gumball machine. These ones aren't really like that. Um, the only issues I've, I had were the sizing was a little bit off and um, the gaudiness, which is not my preference, but it could be your preference. So um, there were no actual like structural issues with these. Um, so that's a plus. And yeah, that is everything. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. Thank you for watching and have an awesome day. Bye.